Okay, I just need to get some money ready, and those Yakuza guys I met at one of my shows, they said they had a good paying job for me. I guess I'll just have to take a chance on that. Let's go. Four minutes now. It's a shooting game. I can't picture Komeji playing this. What? You want me to play this? Oh, uh, I I'm not good at this. Hey there, you look like a shooter. Why don't you give it a shot? This is the goods. I'm gonna take the pay. Don't worry, it's untraceable. Thank you. Oh no. Andy's Komeji was selling firearms? <laughs> huh? Komeji is gone. What? He's over there. Komeji is trying to get on an airplane. His expression is so... dead. Tama, get in position to show Komeji a cue card. What? Another? Uh, what do you want me to say? If you quit now, your debt's only gonna get bigger. Why? I, I gave you all your money! You're nowhere close. Going round and round again, Komeji. You're stuck doing laps for us just like this plane ride. Komeji had a hard time getting away from these shady characters. I'm guessing he could only pay off the interest. Crap! I forgot my bow tie! Hey, where is he going? What is this? I know. If I have this, this is my ticket out of here. This is victory! This is my gold medal! What did Komeji find? I'm going after him. What? Is this...? If I take this with me, they'll have to pay me. There's no way they want this getting found. And it'll fit perfectly in my suitcase. Uh... <laughs> it's just sitting there, practically begging me to take it. If I take this, I can escape this life. This is my chance to finally get ahead. I can't go back now! Komeji took something home in his suitcase. I'm guessing he was going to blackmail someone. But what could it be? Well...
Mr. Komeji, I've taken a look inside your mind. You've been involved in gun trafficking, haven't you? There are other things I'd like to ask you about. May I have a minute of your time? Worried about relationships? Hmm. Something happened with your partner? That must be tough. If you're not married yet, just break up with them. I'm sorry to say this, but if they cheated, it means that person isn't only looking at you. You want them to only look at you. Right? It's going to hurt forever. This isn't something that can be fixed by working harder. Just cut ties with them and find someone new. I'm sure you'll find a better person. That being said, you probably won't listen. I know, that's love. Mr. Komeji, you're treading dangerous waters here. At this rate, Shoma could also be put in danger. Please, talk to me. For Shoma's sake. Shoma, can you protect him? You want me to protect Shoma? As soon as I know he's safe, I'll tell you everything. Shoma safely under custody. I'll put him on the line. Dad! Shoma! Are you okay? No! The cops came and put me in the car, and now they're driving me to the station! I see. What did you do, Dad? The police are after you now? I knew you were dumb, but not that dumb. <sighs> I'm sorry. Shoma, I'll have to fill you in later. I need to talk to your dad for now. Okay, but... All right, Ryuki. I'll leave the rest to you. Now, please continue, Komeji. Or do you prefer Mr. Enda? Yes, I I've racked up a huge amount of debt. I've been getting hounded by collectors. Eventually, they started threatening me with this. Listen, Andy Skomeji, your dear little boy is in elementary school, isn't he? If you don't pay the money you owe in one month, we're taking him and selling him overseas. Am I clear? I couldn't talk to the police. 
about what you said earlier. Gangsters selling guns and I was an accomplice. It was all for money, but... I've always wanted to cut ties with that lot, but I couldn't do it. I had no other way to pay back the money I owed. The money I make as a comedian is just a drop in the bucket. You're right. I was involved with gangs and their gun trafficking operations. That's where I stole the gun I had. I was knee-deep in some dangerous business, and I thought I needed a way to protect myself. Well, the thing on the rooftop of Misaton, you know about it, don't you? Yes. You walked away with it in your suitcase. It was so you could blackmail someone. That's right. Is this related to Horidori Institute somehow? Mr. Ryuki, uh, please take a look at this. A message. Look at the sender. Yeah. A message from Terror. Komeiji, what's going on here? Why do you have a Nile message from a serial killer? That thing I found belonged to Terror. That's what he was talking about in the message. Are you saying you tried to blackmail Terror? I guess so. Anyway, that's why I went to Horidori Institute. The entrance was already open by the time I got there. But there was no one inside, as you know. I had no choice but to wait there. And then you showed up. Do you still intend to hide things from me? <sighs> Mr. Komeji, I'll ask you one more time. What is this thing that's so important to terror? Fine. I'll ask a different question. Where is it now? Will you bring me with you? If you do, I'll tell you. Mr. Komeji, isn't this... Yes, it's my home. This makes so much sense that it's actually confusing. Yeah, it's kind of anticlimactic. So, where can I find it? Ah, oh, right. Uh, <laughs> where was it? I must be getting old. I'm having trouble remembering. Mr. Komeji, please. You can't tell me that after bringing me all the way here. I know, but uh, what am I supposed to do if I can't remember? We have no choice, Ryuki. Let's just start looking around. <laughs> 